Hi guys, Influencer sent me a very exciting box. So if you're not familiar with Influencer, they are a website that you can sign up for for free and you basically just go on and fill out your profile, review a bunch of stuff, promise to review the products they send you, and then they send you free stuff. And sometimes they send you really amazing free stuff. For instance, Marc Jacobs highlighter. I was so excited to get this. This is the new glow stick from Marc Jacobs. There is only one shade. It is supposed to be universal so that everybody can wear it because it has both cool tones and warm tones in it. When I first got it, I was like, oh, that's a cute little deodorant tube. That's nice. That's interesting. And I just swiped it right on and that was a little much. I do not recommend applying it that way. You certainly could if you want Jupiter and Mars to see your highlight. Absolutely. You could also, and this is the way that I think I actually prefer it, do it with your finger to get a wonderful, slightly more subtle glow. It is still super dupes shimmery. Check that out. Now it is pretty pale. I mean, even though it has warm tones in it, that is a pale color. So on me, I don't know if I love it. I really don't. I think it's a beautiful product. I just don't think that this color is truly universal. Maybe it's personal preference. It looks fine on me. It's just really pale. Every time I put it on, I feel like I have to add more blush or more bronzer, you know? I do have it on today and I'm glowing like crazy, right? I kind of put a lot on, but I wanted you guys to be able to see the color and how intensely shimmery this can be. And it is really beautiful. It really, really is. I love that it has both warm and cool tones in it. I just think that it's a little pale. So if you use it, just, you know, kind of dab it lightly. I think you can get away with it more than if you apply it intensely. Like, don't swipe it on your face. Don't. I don't recommend that. You could use a sponge, but also I feel like I don't get good results that way. I'm telling you, I like it best with either my finger or today I used the Real Techniques contour brush to put it on. And you know, I mean, you can see that's, that's a lot, but I think that it does apply nicely. And for a cream product, it blends out so beautifully. Even on top of powder products, it just blends gorgeously. Well, I'm telling you, it is a beautiful product. I just don't know that I love it for me. And obviously being Marc Jacobs, this is going to be a pricey item, but you do get a lot of product. And unless you are swiping it on like a crazy person, it will last you a while as well. I really do hope that they come out with more shades because if they came out with a darker, warmer tone, I would totally repurchase this because I think it's really, really nice. And as you can see, it gets the job done. So anyway, thank you Influencer and Marc Jacobs for letting me test this out for you. I love it. I think it's beautiful. I would highly recommend it, especially to fairer skin tones. You could absolutely, as a darker skin tone, wear this. Just be aware that it is a very pale color, even though it does have warm and cool tones in it. I love that it has both warm and cool. I really do. Anyway, I think that this is a beautiful product and I would highly recommend it. So thank you guys for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!